months of planning and preparation transitioned to action as crews from the U.S. Department of Energy Environmental Management Nevada program began demolition of four buildings at Area 25 of the Nevada National Security Sites. The buildings are located at the Test Cell C facility and were recognized in the Environmental Management CY23 mission and priorities. Both Test Cell C, or TCC, and the Engine Maintenance Assembly and Disassembly Facility, also known as EMAD, were part of the now inactive Nuclear Rocket Development Station, or NRDS. The NRDS supported the development and testing of nuclear rocket engines from 1957 until 1973. All Kiwi power tests took place at the Nuclear Rocket Development Station at Jackass Flats, Nevada. Here in the desert, scientists and engineers checked the actual performance at various power levels and for various time periods. This jointly administered effort was carried out between the Atomic Energy Commission, predecessor to the Department of Energy, and the National Aeronautics and Space Administration. Decades later, the United States Department of Energy's Environmental Management Nevada program is tasked with demolishing and disposing of these sites. Prior to the beginning of demolition, the buildings were radiologically surveyed and deactivated with the removal of any identified hazardous components such as asbestos and liquids like oil and hydraulic fluid. Additionally, perlite, used as insulation in the four doers that stored hydrogen, was also carefully removed and packaged. Every precaution is taken to perform the work and package the debris safely and securely. Dust suppression is handled with water and spotters were in place for the vehicle operators. The rest of the building debris you're seeing here is considered industrial waste. And before a truck is released from the work site to head for disposal, the load is tarped and the truck is checked for any signs of radioactivity, as is the bucket of the excavator. The waste will stay on the NNSS in Nevada transported to the U10C landfill. Despite extreme summer desert conditions, the EM Nevada program stayed on task accomplishing planned objectives ahead of schedule. We leave you today with some additional views of the work completed at TCC.